This is Larry Bonarotto from LarryOnLearning.com, and this is your Morning Minute. What are you afraid of? We all face making decisions, decisions concerning opportunities, problems, setbacks, or mistakes. Decisions forced on us by our own actions or the actions of others. We face fear and self-doubt. Question, do we fear the decision or the consequences of our decision? For instance, what happens if I fail? How will this affect my future? What effect will this have on my family, my career, or my income? What happens if I succeed? Do I have the knowledge and resources to take advantage of success? What if I lose my confidence before I finish? What happens if I'm not good enough? Am I really as good as I think I am? Am I really the best person to make this decision and handle the results? What happens if no one buys into my decision? Will I be rejected or fired because of it? What if no one else agrees with my decision or the methods necessary to achieve success? What happens when someone else has a better idea? Suppose my idea is great, but theirs is better. Assuming that outcome, what happens to me or my idea? Through the years, I've been faced with making numerous decisions that affect me, my family, and others. To aid me in decision making, I was required to employ a process. This process required me answering these three questions honestly. Based on this decision, number one, what is the best outcome that can happen? Number two, what is the worst outcome that can happen? Number three, do the benefits outweigh the risks? Using this process helped me to accept responsibilities with numerous diverse organizations. The process took me from being a kitchen cook to supervising multiple restaurants. It aided my transition from rookie salesperson to managing auto dealerships with multiple franchises. These opportunities included leadership positions in my church, exchange, and rotary clubs. To be sure, there were failures along the way. However, by focusing on the best outcomes instead of worrying about failure, our teams achieved phenomenal success. So I ask again, what are you afraid of? Because fear is natural, it limits your decision-making success by allowing fear to control your actions. Adopt this process. Focus on the best outcomes instead of worrying about possible failures. Let your view of success guide your decisions. Realize that even the best plan may require you to pivot slightly to stay on course. Then make your decision and support it completely. And that is today's Morning Minute.